What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Gage from GB Resale King on YouTube and Poshmark. 50 Shades of Gage on eBay. That's five zero Shades of Gage on eBay. It's a beautiful Saturday morning. It's a little bit chilly, but not nearly as cold as it was yesterday. Dad and I are about to hit the sales. So if you could, give this video a like, comment down below, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And if you are subscribed, welcome to King's Court. We'll see you in a bit. Neutral bullet. Neutral bullet. This for three bucks. Oh. DVD player? No. Three bucks? No. Any of these brats or. Two dollars for that bag, though. Yeah, I don't know. There's another two dollars. box right there is probably worth three dollars easy that's vintage mm -hmm. and all these barbies you got a ton of them toy story Somewhere I saw a, like a Star Wars, not a Star Wars, but it was a Monopoly, a special one in that picture. Oh. Another monopoly I saw in the picture. Did you go five on this? Um, 
I honestly, uh, is, is this all your group? Is this your stuff over here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll give you a group price. How's that? Thank you. Yeah. I know I saw another Monopoly in your ad, too. Picture. Like a, the picture I saw another one. It was either Star Wars or. Okay. This, this looks brand new. This is brand new. This is brand new, Gage. Two dollars. <coughs> battle, battle of the sexes. I saw another Monopoly in your ad, I know. Do you have another Monopoly there in your ad? Um, was, it was just on that table. I got it right here. I got that one. But I, on the ad, I saw another one that was a... Okay. How much are the plushes? Uh, let's do a dollar, or I'll, I'll give you a group, but no more than a dollar each. Yeah. Small one's 50 cents. All right, good. Sense for the small ones. All right. Did you want um, I just found this truck you're interested or not really? It's all complete. Two dollars, yeah, I guess. Yeah, okay. Right. 
Yep. Oh, by the way, look what time it is. It's time to hit that like button and subscribe. Thank you very much. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Some nice heads. Turn that little thing on, but keep your hands away from the doors. <laughs> Seriously, it's fine. Gage. Fifty cents on bills. There's jeans over there. Let me buy a whole living room set for seventy-five bucks. Did someone else take the other two? Oh, you have three hats. Yep. Yes, they did. How much were they? I don't even know. 50, 50 cents? cents? You yeah. take a dollar for the three? Yeah. All right. They've been in my closet for 20 years. Okay. <laughs> All right. Here, Sam. We like them old. You know, one time, shoot, they're probably, they could still be worth a lot of money. They're all Abercrombie. So my husband's um, oh, sister Oh, they're all would, Abercrombie. Maybe not that one, but yeah. these two definitely. Yeah. Um, she was a regional manager for Abercrombie, so... We have a lot of vintage stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Yeah, we like vintage. Thanks. This is a cold air intake. My yeah. husband doesn't never use. He doesn't remember what car it is. Three bucks is good. Take it. Three dollars. All yours. right. I'll take it. Tinker with it. Yes, I will. Because I've got both foreign and American. There you go. All right. How much for that whole box so I don't have to look through it all? Yeah, fine. Whole box. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh. That way I don't have to There's look through it. There's a ton of them in there, right? I don't know. Oh. Oh, give me three bucks. Okay. I'll take them that They're way out. They're pretty much the same size. I'll look at them later. This is ten. You gotta get this. How many of the shoes on time? What brand is it? Huh? What brand is it? Yeah. Snowzilla? 25. It's a large. It's got the tag on huh? Seems 40 on the tag. Mm -hmm. Huh? All right. I think that's about $20 all day long. Yeah. Right here. Mm -hmm. Well, those are cool. Mm -hmm. yeah, those are cool. Are they bobbleheads? I don't think they are. What do you want for those? Oh, I'll stop. $5 each. Any bobbleheads? Is it a bobblehead? Oh, yeah, it is. Hmm. Yeah. Right. You go five on both of them? Five for both? Oh, no. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Gage is buying some stuff from me. It's all Coca Cola stuff. Go seven on the both? What's that? Seven on both of I'll them? I'll go seven. I'll go seven. Yeah. What do you got there? What are you doing there? These are, um, these are little crafts. Um, some are not even opened, but it's uh, they're little paper crafts. So oh. each kit is a, um, has something different. Okay. It comes with everything. Oh, How much are you asking for those? Beautiful. Um, five dollars. A piece. Yeah. yeah. They were twenty-five. No, no, no. Yeah. And I got a little crazy with buying them all and doing all the stamping up stuff, and then but most of them are all unopened. All right, I owed you seven on the bobbleheads. Bobbleheads. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 
What are those things? He it's said a, a they're crafts. Craft, craft kit. She said she paid twenty a piece, so she wants yeah, five a piece. piece. I'm doing. And each one comes with. Each kit is different, it's, and they come with everything you need to make. Like the, these are cards. There's five cards in each of these. No, the stamp and each all one is different. Each yep. Box. Yep. What would you do for all of them? For all of them, uh, well, five bucks. Let me count them. No. Good morning. How are you today? Good. Good. You have any video? Okay. I missed out yesterday. <laughs> Through these gates, she said, Oh, there's a PlayStation right there. One, two. She said there was games in here. Do rags. Harley do rags. Nice socks. Mega car. What is that? Marvel. Yeah, please. You don't ever want the medicated they come from a hat trick because they already get the stuff to them. Yes. Yeah, they died. So they were all doing really good. And then about oh, six or seven bad. days, they all died within Let me ask 24 you hours. Tasty butt. Do you know what that is? Yes, it's pretty damn good. Right. And yeah. you had to clean it. Yep. Okay. Like, Missing a shoe too. He's supposed to. Yeah, he's missing a shoe. Yeah, I think he's supposed to. Oh, he's supposed to be. Yeah, I believe so. Could be. He's he's like hobo. a hobo guy. I think so. The... And I, it's not Red Skelton. No. I think it'd be earlier. Yeah. See okay. if she'll do. Oh, okay. Five on two of them or something. This, is, this one is a twenty and two out there. Let's see if we can make a deal on all three of them. 
What's he asking? All right, my dear. How much do you want? Let's see if she'll go. Six nine. I don't know. I think that's probably a deal. figure out who they are. I put my ex fiance through massage school because I thought, oh cool, I'll be able to get massages. Yeah. So go work on the baby if you home and if you don't want to do more massages. Oh sure. <laughs> okay, so what's the cameras? Uh GoPro. Yeah. Okay. We have a YouTube channel. Okay, that's he, cool. He has a YouTube channel. I didn't sign now I didn't sign, I didn't go sign a no release. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> and I drove that bike forever, you know, uh -huh. kickstart. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It had the decompression lever on oh, it. Oh, yeah, 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 yep. So you could mm -hmm. get a good jump on it. Uh huh. And I rode that bike forever. Yeah. Sold it. Put in a quarter. Yeah. yeah. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Gage from GB Resale King, 50 Shades of Gage on eBay and Poshmark. Dad and I are back from the sales room. It was a massive day of sourcing. We did awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and switch to give you a shout out what we picked up. But if you could like this video, give a comment down below. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Share to all your friends. And if you are subscribed, welcome to King's Court. I really appreciate all the support. And we'll see you in a bit. Hey Sammy, who's that beautiful Siamese kitty? Hey baby. All right, YouTube, we'll start over here. Um, a while back, I had bought out the rest. The guy had a yard sale, and I went back and gave him forty-five bucks, I think, and bought out the rest of his stuff, like an electric edger and um, a faucet, a bicycle, stuff like that. Well, we just drove by him today. We seen him working in the garage. Just stopped to say hi. And uh, he's like, hey, I got some more stuff if you guys want it. So he gave us this here. It's a box full of china. This one's, I think they're, they might all be Nippon, Japan. So that was pretty cool. Um, two totes full of books. This one's got trigonometry, calculus, a bunch of different textbooks. So I'm gonna go through them, see what I want and what I don't want. I'll just throw out and or recycle and uh, use the tote. Here's another tote full of textbooks and stuff he gave us. This giant igloo cooler he gave us. And this is a foam topper for a mattress. Um, if I don't end up using it, I could cut it up. Hey, Gracie. Hey, Gracie. I might end up cutting it up and use it for packaging materials if I don't end up using it on the bed. At the first sale we went to, I, I bought a lot of stuff. I, I spent like 60 bucks. Um, this was one of the things here. It's a G.I. Joe construction set. Paid $3. It's a Deadpool plushie and action figure for a dollar. This is a doll assortment. I'm not sure what it is. Um, maybe if you could comment down below, it's RH. I think it stands for like something high, but I'm not sure. If you know who, who these dolls are, comment down below. Got this entire bag full of M&M's plushies for three bucks. Here's a bag with three different Cabbage Patch Kids for three dollars. I bought this Vivitar digital camera and this digital Vivitar for 50 cents each at that yard sale. This Samsung digital camera was a dollar at another yard sale. I love old cameras. I'm really looking for like a Canon M200 or M50, a Pentax Q7 or like a Sony Alpha Series 5300, something like that. 
uh, compact mirrorless camera. So if you, if I see any or if you all have any, know any you want to get rid of, just let me know. This model right here, 1950 Chevy Stepside. It's like dust is like on the inside or something, but models sell like crazy for me. As soon as I list them, they're gone pretty much. At that first sale, I got this Lego City Farmer's Market van for 10 bucks. This is a um, Lego Chicken Hen House for $3. And you see the guy, they got solid gold right there, those eggs. Yeah, I already showed it. Lego Creator, three and one for five bucks I paid. To make a witch, a dragon, or a cat. Got this guy for 25 cents. It's kind of like Stretch Armstrong. He's like squishy and stretchy. Lego Speed Champions, Aston Martin Vanquish, or Aston Martin Valkyrie for $2. This is Lego VIP Treasures, Pirates and Treasure VIP add-on pack. Paid $2. Got another pirate add-on pack for $2. This is a VIP Fun and Funky VIP add-on pack. It's got like pineapples and all kinds of funky stuff. Pigs, that was $2. Then at that sale, I picked up a few of these Squishmallows too. I think this is a, a real Squishmallow, but the tag is ripped off, unfortunately. But this is a really cute Squishmallow Mermaid. The Narwhal Mermaid. I don't know her name. This is BB-8 from Star Wars. I believe it's a Squishmallow too, but I can't tell because the tag's been ripped off of this too. Just the Star Wars tag is left. This is a Squishmallow. Looks like a Corgi or something. A Thai Minion. And looks like maybe a knockoff Squishmallow Bumblebee. These were all, all 50 cents for the small ones. These ones here were also there. They're like knockoffs Squishmallows, but they're still, they might be Moosh Moosh brand, but I can't really tell. Got Woody along his trusty steed. Those were a dollar each at one sale. I picked up Four Blind Mice by James Patterson. James Patterson and Lee Child are my favorite authors. So I'm not even sure if I read this one, but I picked it up for a dollar. Monopoly Classic Edition Sealed for $2. This electronic battleship was a dollar. Live Dave Matthews Band at Folsom Field in Boulder, Colorado. I've never been to Colorado, but I heard it's beautiful. This is a Hot Wheels customized GMC 3500. It's, it's like my dually, but it's purple in flames. I wouldn't mind if mine was purple, but it looks really good blacked out. This is a Nintendo tin, and it just comes with a keychain and a little um, lanyard tag. That was a dollar. This is a Mifa Six Colors Gel Polish Set, 50 cents, and it's got all the different little gel nail polish colors in there I did really good I bought them um, a full case with like 18 Ahura they were like um, semi cured gel nail stickers it had like 19 of the the boxes it came with a gel lamp and everything I paid 15 bucks from the guy and I sold it for 145 bucks that was a good come up dad wasn't sure anybody would buy it this is a Hogwarts mug for 25 cents. And I can't remember Harry Potter's owl name. 
is familiar, but he's on there. I got this beautiful necklace. I'm not sure what kind of stone, if it's a geode or what, but it's got a little feather there. And I picked this up for my little sister because she loves this color, turquoise color. This is an Elgin watch. And it comes with the, the matching bracelet. I thought that was gorgeous. And I, it was a dollar for both of these. Oh, maybe this car right here, it's the same as those dolls. RH, so maybe it's rainbow high. Might have just figured it out myself. Um, that was three dollars, so that's probably rainbow high for the dolls. This is a Sony RDP M7IP. It's a portable stereo speaker for your iPhone. That was a dollar. This is a really cool looking Mickey Mouse. He's like lounging at the beach. He's got little flip flops on. That was a dollar. I got this shirt here. It's pretty cool. Savage. It says legend on it. Hustle. Fresh. I had asked about this and um, a United States of America, like a presidential sweatshirt. She told me $10 or $5 each. So. I had kind of set it back down, but then she told my dad $2. He picked it back up for me. These are laser jeans. I picked them up to see if my mom wanted them because it reminded me of something she might wear. I'll let her take a look at them. If she don't want them, then I'll sell them. This box right here has got all kinds of different shirts in it like vintage shirts um dad just gave her three dollars for his, looks like a lot of them are from transitions brand or something i picked up this entire bag full of disney characters for three dollars pluto donald mickey goofy Mini, and then another Donald. That was three bucks. This is a Easton Volt Bat. That was a dollar. Got an Easton Stealth Comp Bat. That was a dollar. And Easton Octane Big Barrel Baseball Bat for a dollar. I was going to buy all the bats that she had there, but one was missing the cap on the end. The other one, the handle was crunched. And then the last one was just a little t-ball bat. So I just left those and picked up these three. Got this Hot Wheels carrier. It's like a shark. I've never seen, um, I've never seen a shark. Normally they're like a big truck, you know, that carries all of them. This one, this one makes noise too. Got lights. So that was pretty cool. They were asking 10. Dad got them down to five. And then he took another like $7.50 off of the uh, DN price anyways. I got these three dolls for $3 a piece. It's by a co uh, company called Orma, handmade in Thailand. Um, they're made porcelain, hands, face, and everything. And I, th this is Chaplin, I believe. And if anybody else can comment down below, I believe this is Red Skelton. He's playing a hobo. He's got his shoe torn, one shoe off. You know, patches on the clothes. That's the face. And then, I think this is another comedian lady. I can't remember her name either, so if anybody could comment down below. 
I used to see her on like when I was younger on some type of sketch comedy show. So if anybody could recognize her, I know she played like an old like grandma, but she was like a crazy grandma. We picked up this Spider-Man piggy bank for a dollar. Dad's gonna put that in his collection because he collects um, action figures, comic books, stuff like that. Star Wars. Led Zeppelin Remasters set. It's got three discs and the manual. Well, four discs and the manual. Dad also collects records, LPs. So I picked up four of these. They're normally like eight or nine dollars a piece. He got them for they're a dollar each. He got them for a dollar each, four for a dollar each. This was in a free box. I just grabbed it so I can use it to ship stuff. I like to use some um, recycled shipping materials because it saves me money and it saves stuff from going to the landfill. Here's a um, Coca-Cola bottle opener. This is a Borderlands 3 um, plushy backpack. I can't remember the, the character name or what it's from, but I just know it's from Borderlands. These are some of those nice little fleece blankets. Our cats love these to sleep on. They're, they're soft for them. This right here is pretty cool. It's battery powered. Street Sweeper, it was $3. I don't know what brand it is. It looks, reminds me of a Brooder, but it's really nice, nicely built. And at the same first yard sale, I picked up this one too. $2, battery powered, and it's a, a wrecker, flatbed wrecker. And Dad bought this bag right here. It's got some old Hot Wheels in it with the, the metal bottoms. That's how you know they're older. This one's plastic, so it's newer, newer, but there's some, there's some old ones in there for sure. This is a Lamborghini. Dad got it for 50 cents. Some closet flanges. Uh, as you can imagine, my closet with all the clothing and stuff I have for sale and out in the warehouse, it gets heavy on those racks. So sometimes they tend to break if they're plastic. I got this manga, Inuyasha for 50 cents, volume one. It's a little beat up and stuff, but somebody will probably want that. This is an Ipsy makeup bag that was in a free pile. Here's a Scentsy Warmer, new in the box. Comes with scents. Slurpee Cups, brand new. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them. That was a um, dollar, I think. This is John 1513 patch. Don't tread on me. Dilly, dilly gap. I think it's something about give a F. American flag. Those were quarter each. This is sealing wax. And then the, the stamp. It was a dollar for that. There's some craftsman tools that I got for like a quarter each or something like that. Bag of nuts. And then two of these little wall hooks. Dad collects guitars so he might be able to use these for guitars or mandolin or something like that if the neck is too small. Got this little Hot Wheels car collection for like $2 or $1. These are all Disney, McDonald's, or Burger King toys. 
Here's Animaniac. Nope, that's Mickey Mouse. Look like Animaniacs. But got this whole bag of those. This is a cold air intake. Not sure what vehicle, but it's got the entire tube set up and everything. I think she charged them three bucks. Um, got this PS3 game. PS3 game. Another PS3 game. And two PS2 games. Those were a dollar a piece. Final Fantasy X is definitely sought after. I picked up this True Blood Complete First Season DVD set. If you're into vampires and stuff like that, I highly recommend watching True Blood. It's it's really cool show. I picked up this Betsyville laptop bag for two dollars. And organic lavender grow kit. Everything included, just add water. Originally $24.98. Paid three bucks for that. <clears throat> Up here. Got a few vintage hats. How many licks does it take? How many does it take? I can only get the three. Abercrombie and Fitch. R and R Ranch. Those were cheap. These here, 511 Tactical um, Cargo Pants, and these are True Spec. There's one, two, three, four, five pairs of True Spec, and the 511 Tactical. Those, he wanted five dollars a piece, but I think he went down to three. I'll have to double check. I picked up this Wilda Genuine Leather jacket American flag I paid 15 bucks for it that was cool got a fake snake out of a box gonna see if the cats like it or not and then this is what I spent most of my money on today she wanted a hundred bucks Offered her 40, then she went down to 80, and then 75, I think. I offered her 70. But what they are is they're like those monthly boxes you have shipped, you know, the subscriptions. It's by a company called Paper Pumpkin. I've never heard of it. But each one is a different craft item. Here's a stamp set. Um, they're all different craft ideas. You get one every month or whatever. And she says for the prescription subscription, it's normally $25 a month or for each box. Here's the one that's got frames in it. Different stickers, glue dots, and then, you know, other stamp inks. So she wanted $5 a piece, but I talked her down to, I think it was 70, 65 bucks plus the... $20 well, all the stuff I have it came out to like $75 or $85 total something like that Man, my mind is my memory is slipping already So that's what we got today YouTube um, If you know anybody that would enjoy this content, please share with them and have them subscribe if you could like this video give a comment down below Letting me know um, if you enjoyed it, if you anything you've seen that we should have picked up. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. I really enjoy making these videos, and I hope you enjoy watching them just as much. All right, YouTube. Peace out.